Hello everybody and welcome back to the Infinite Library. Thank you for joining me on this wonderful weekend, this sensational Saturday afternoon. I hope everybody is doing well today. Extra B, congratulations on nabbing first. Love that for you. And I mostly love it for me because that means you're here and you're here early and also you're super hot and I, you know, like having you around. Appleton, how's it going? I think that was, Apple, do you think I did good there? You think that, that, that was smooth? Like, don't don't tell Hex. I think I might have a little bit of a crush on her. I'm trying to, like, keep it low-key, you know, trying to... I'm, I'm trying to keep it on the down low, keep it, uh, you know, nice and chill. I think I'm doing a good job. Fate Rider, how's it going? Thank you for joining us as well. I'm glad you enjoy the videos. Thank you for popping over to the stream here. Um, it'll be a, bit, a little bit of a, a, a distinctly different flavor when I'm live because of how my brain works when I'm live versus when I'm writing stuff down. So, we'll we'll see how it goes. I say, why is my wrist broken? Oh my god, what is happening? Hand, 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 hand tracking? No, oh god, oh this ain't right. That's not good, oh no. Oh, we have issues. Oh, we've, we're scuffed today, chat. Help me, someone's, chat help me, someone's got me. <laughs> They're trying to pull me away. <laughs> why is my, <laughs> I think I need to I think I need to reset my hand tracking. <laughs> Hang on. Let me restart this really quick. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> restart the hand tracking. <laughs> That's not right. Uh I, okay, there we go. I got caught on the ceiling fan for a second there or something. I'm just gonna blame Windows Update because whenever my computer is being funky for any reason, I blame Windows Update and I'm usually right. Anyway, you're probably going to hear me say the word balls a lot more. Also, did I trim up my hair? I need to fix that a little bit. Boop. There we go. That should do it. Um, and also, we're going to be playing Castlevania today, which is always a good time. So I've been making my way through the uh, the Castlevania series. Hey, uh, Jakester, thank you for the lurk. Appreciate it. I've been making my way through the Castlevania series on Saturdays. Uh, we played the original three uh, on NES. Well, we're playing the Wii U versions, uh, which means we've basically been save scumming our way through them with save states. We're on Castlevania 4, um, originally on the Super Nintendo. This is basically a remake of Castlevania 1, but with like a lot more levels at the... St I mean, I, sh I shouldn't say a remake. It's a retelling of the story. The actual level design and gameplay is like totally new. So it is just, you know... An excuse to have a new Castlevania game without having any new, like, st real plot elements or anything like that. Not that, you know, NES and Super Nintendo games usually have a ton of plot. You know, every now and then you'll get, like, a Final Fantasy or something like that. But, um, yeah, this is just, you're playing a Simon Go Kill Dracula again. Which is, it's, um, kind of funny how this one worked out with because... Like, Castlevania 1 is your Simon, go kill Dracula. Uh, Castlevania 2 is the sequel uh, to that one, where you're Simon again, and it takes place afterwards. Castlevania 3 is the prequel to Castlevania 1, because you're playing as his, like, grandfather, ancestor, whatever it is. You're playing as Trevor in that one, and it's, like, hundreds, several hundreds years prior. I don't know exactly the dates offhand. Um, so this one is, like also kind of a pre it's like a sequel to three like this is castlevania four it's a sequel to three and it's like retelling one but it also has a lot more stuff before one like the first entire batch of levels are just simon getting up to the castle uh which we've basically reached it now um versus actual castlevania one you just kind of start right at the outside the castle at the beginning of it have i seen the rogue cut actually i have not i've, I've actually never seen the rogue cut of uh, Days of Future Past. I think I've only seen like the uh, theatrical cut like once or twice. Uh, okay, let me let's jump back into this and let's see. Uh, do let's turn my controller on. That'll help. So yes, this game's originally on the Super Nintendo. We are playing the uh, the Wii U Virtual Console version. And so it's hard to use my sub weapons. I can do it a flippy dips with the whippy whips. It's gonna take me a minute to get back into the swing of things. Um, we are using like save states, but basically just to save state at the, uh, checkpoints for the sake of not having to do a ton of, uh, uh basically, oh, hang on, 
Oh, right, I can do, like, different direction in this one, and I can do, like, flip it up, there we go, okay. I just gotta get back into the the hang of the controls again, because this game does feel a lot better than the uh, the NES versions, all things considered. Uh, can I turn the volume up a little bit? I think I will. There we go, that's better. Gotta hear that bang music. There we go. There we go. We finally got to the castle, we finally got the, uh, the classic vampire killer track. So we gotta pump that a little bit at least. Bop, bop, bop. And uh, I hit my head. That didn't work. <laughs> exactly, Appleton. Take this! <laughs> Alright, we back in it. We back into the Castlevania. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Ha, okay. We Gucci. We all Gucci in this Gucci. There we go. Oh, you gotta get like a circular motion if you get into the, uh... Oh, hang on. Oh, I can totally use the... Because when I'm playing this on a... Because I'm playing this with a uh, uh, Wii Classic controller. So, like, normally I'm using the D-pad, like, originally intended. But um, for that flippy thing, I can use the uh, the control stick to... Uh, <laughs> I can totally use the control stick to go, like, Woo! Oh, that's so much easier to do. <laughs> that's a little cheesy. That's fun, though. Whoop! We have modern technology. That classic controller is the bane of your existence. I like it for... I'm playing this on the Wii U, so normally I would use, like, the Wii U Pro controller for games that I play on this system. But this is, like, originally a Super Nintendo game. So, this thing just is basically shaped like a Super Nintendo controller with some extra bits on it. So, for Super Nintendo games, I like this. For Super Nintendo games, it works. For If I was playing an N64 game, or, you know, a Wii U game, then I would use the Pro Controller. What? 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 Or like NES games, if this works for these. I, I, this is what I played the, uh, the NES Castlevanias with. Okay. I might... Huh? Oh, there we go. That uh, did, that did not look like it was going to make that jump, but okay. Um, oh right, this one's bullshit. Case in point. That was some hot garbage right there. Okay. Eek. Oh god. Oh god. Huh. Simon. Whoop. I do like how there's some uh, elements of the uh, the clockwork stage from uh, Castlevania 3 mixed into this. Like, this is... This game is primarily, like, a reimagined... That's a good word for it. It's not a remake. It's a reimagining of Castlevania 1. But, um... This section here is very much, like, Castlevania 3 clockwork. The, uh, the clock tower where you go up if you want to, uh, get ran. It's like a completely optional area. Hi, Sky. How's it going? That's my favorite walrus doing. Gosh... Dang it. Woo! Ba da 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 Hi Shiro, how's it going? Those pre-roll ads were loud the ads were unnecessarily loud? Oh no, I hate that. I hate when you're uh watching something either on Twitch or YouTube or whatever it is. I hate when the the ad is, like, unnecessarily loud. Then it just cuts to a la ad, and you're like, ah, my ears! Hi, Shiro, by the way. And Zilla, how's it going? Yes, the one and only Sky, the walrus. We love Sky around here. We stand... 
sky thy walrus. That sounds more like a uh, direct. Thou must sky thine walrus. I don't know what it means, but Ross said, "How's it going? Thank you for joining us as well." Okay, hang on. Huh. There we go. And I can. Huh. Okay, hang on. Huh. And huh. Huh. That does not. Oh, I jumped onto the stairs. I see. That's why I was confused. Because for three solid games before this, jumping onto the stairs was like a physical impossibility. Huh. Okay. Now. Um. Uh. Oh, I see. I see. That's okay. I think I'm. That's why I had. Okay. I did not see that there before. Woo! Huh. Got it. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Okay. Oh, the Super Nintendo slowdown. Oh, too much on the screen. Even the music is going like... It's supposed to do that now. Okay, we're Gucci. Medusa head. Oh god. Oh god. Oh boy. Alright. Ha! Ha! Oh. Aha! Threw a knife at a skeleton and he exploded. How was stream? I well I threw a knife at a skeleton and then he exploded, so that was go oh god, 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 oh god. Oh jeez, um oh jeez. Oh no! Was there a checkpoint? Yes there was, okay. I gotta power up my whip again. Huh. Ow! Okay. Okay, let's not jump into the spikes this time. Oh. Whoop. Okay. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, got my knife back. Oh, oh my god, my whip is so short. I'm a grower, chat. Don't worry about it. It's cold in here. Fuck! There's a longer one. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. What's happening? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Flubbada, flubbada, flubbada. I stand here, kiss. Ha! Come here, you. Yep, 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 yep. Gotcha. Okay. Woo! I'm doing it. Oh, significant shrinkage. Yeah, but now I'm full size. Now we're ready to go. You know, sometimes it just takes me... Oh, good lord! Sometimes it just takes me a second to warm up. Uh, <laughs> I got you, Apple. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, gears. Oh, God. No, no, no. Oh, I see. <laughs> Immediately helicoptering, gotta assert dominance. Oh, oh, I got. These guys are trying to throw their bones at me. Huh. Oh. It's like that time I tried going on Grinder and gave it up within 48 hours! Oh, god damn it! Okay, everything's fine. We got this. I we get, We're all over this. Don't even worry about it. Everything will be good. Give me this. Oh, bone! Oh, bone! No bones about it, mister. Oh, he exploded. Okay. Ugh! Ah. Ugh. ah, God, I hate it when a guy is trying to throw his bones at you and then he just explodes in your face. Good Lord. Ugh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Alrighty. Okay, chat. Okie dokie. Alright then. Huh. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Ugh. Yeah. Get out of my way. No, you dick. Give me the thing. 
got the thing. Oh, thing acquired. Ugh. You can't bonk me, Zilla. It's my chat. Come on, man. I get no respect. That chat bonking me. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm being bullied. Oh, God in heaven. Okay. Oh, Okay, everything's fine. I don't know what you're panicking over, chat. I have full control over the situation. Oh, crosses. Oh, oh, he, who, ha, who, ha. Okay, okay. Oh, oh, he, who, ha, who, he, who, ha, who, arg. Okay. <laughs> Ow, no. Come here, you will rip your face off. You didn't even drop anything, you cheap bastard. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. Yes. Okay. 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 We're going up. Oh, 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 I got the holy water. When did that happen? This is this is a spicy situation. No! I knew it! <sighs> you can bonk whoever you like. Hell yeah, you can. As long as the bonker and the bonky are... I knew that was going to happen because... This is one of those levels where the screen scroll will kill you. So even though I was just that down there, touching like the bottom of the screen will kill me. And it is indeed bull honky. So uh, I gotta like stay to the left because that's where the uppies are. Hang on, did I? Okay, no. Okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, stop. Making sure I reloaded the checkpoint so I'm not down a life unnecessarily. Whew, whew. Always bound consensually. Exactly. Okay. Those instant death spikes are just mean. I'll keep in mind that I am cheesing this with save states in order to uh, uh, not game over. Um, traditionally playing this on original hardware, oh, you dick. Um, if you die, like, four or five times, and you are redoing larger, much larger sections of the game. God, you dingus. There we go. Okay. Not even cheesing. Yeah, I'm not. I wouldn't say I'm cheesing it, but uh, yeah. I, I, on original hardware, I would definitely be needing to replay a lot more. Like this game would be a lot more punishing if I wasn't uh, save stating. Is what I'm saying, <laughs> which is uh, some shenaniganery. Yeah, just a, just a little greed of cheese. It'd be cool if the boomerang didn't use up a hurt if I caught it. That'd be fun. Oh, God. No, oh, God. Okay, we're good. Ha! Okay. Huh! No! Alright. 
Okay. Okay. I see how it is. I see how it's gonna be. I just need to make that one jump. Oh god. Oh god. There's one jump between me and success. Oh, come on! Oh, right, that's why I brought this up. The game over mechanics and, like, the, the small, smaller amount of lives on original hardware. That, that's what makes stuff like that instant death spike placement just mean. That's just mean. <laughs> Whoop! Oh, oh, I'm a god. Okay. Hooey, 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 hooey. Oh, are you kidding me? Bullshit. Uh, oh, god, okay. Some shenaniganery. Oh, kitties. Mine is asleep on the on the bed. I got one over there. She has a, uh, a vet appointment on Tuesday. When I'm, I'm, I know I'm going to be streaming... Um, Zelda on Tuesday evening, so heads up, uh, that may or may not be late, depending on how long the, uh, the vet appointment goes, um, with luck, it'll just be a quick in and out inspection and everything will be fine, and then we'll go home and I can stream, so hopefully, you know, it's nothing, uh, nothing to worry about. Oh. Okay. Ow, ow bone. How would you like more bones, man? Ow. Oh, God. Oh, God. Come on, just. Ugh. Ooh. Yeah, games used to be made to be punishing. Absolutely. Yeah, in old arcade games, they were all just like quarter suckers. Back, back in the arcade ga days when every game was pay to win. Ow, you dick! <laughs> I mean, a lot of these old games are also hard because if they're not, then they're like 15 minutes long. But also the arcade thing. Like the design sensibilities. Oh, heck. The design sensibilities of old arcade games was to make them, like, you know, punishing quarter suckers. Ow. Ugh. I'm losing it, man. I'm doing worse. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Get out of here. Oh. Oh yeah, the Skeletor voice is too good for Papyrus. I think we all owe Alan Oppenheimer a uh, debt of gratitude for uh, defining how skeletons should sound. Oh god. Funny enough, Skeletor is not even really a skeleton. He just has a skull for a head. He's got like a big beefy blue muscle body and then a skull for a head. It was creepy in, like, the 2000s cartoon where, on, like, rare occasions, you'd see him with his hood down, and it was just, like, a floating skull where his head should be. They have, like, a whole origin story for him in that version that was, uh, pretty badass. Where, uh... Oh, God. 
where he tried to like kill the King Randor with acid and had it like knocked back into his face that was like melting his entire head away. Um, and he made a deal with the demon Hordak to uh, stay alive and was be and you know was transformed from the sorcerer Keldor into undead. I don't know if he would. Well, not really undead, but in into Skeletor. God no. Maybe I can, like, proc it, like, by climbing up and then dodge it by dropping down. Ugh. That, uh, early 2000s Masters of the Universe cartoon was really dope. And I'm sad that it got cancelled before they got to doing Hordak proper or introducing She-Ra or stuff like that. That would have been fun. Oh, God. Yeah, I think the most we got of his backstory in the original cartoon was that he worked for Hordak at one point. But he was like still already Skeletor back then in the old cartoon. Ah, okay. Huh. Oh god. For those who are only like tangentially aware of uh, the characters, He-Man from Masters of the Universe and She-Ra, Princess of Power, are uh, actually brother and sister. Wins? I don't remember at all. Either way, separated as, like, you know, babies and, uh, oh god. Or He-Man, Prince Adam, grew up on his, uh, home planet of Eternia. Uh, Adora, She-Ra, was brought to, um... Uh, I want to say Adenia, but I think I think that's Mortal Kombat, so I don't remember the name of it. It's been a while. Yeah, I haven't watched the uh, the more recent She-Ra cartoon. Uh, it's something that I need to watch at some point. Cool chat. Ooh, two of those, nice. Huh. Oh god, oh god, oh no, 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 no. Okay. Okay. This one's some bullshit. Jiminy Christmas. You grew up on the new adventures of He-Man. I barely... I, I don't think I've ever really watched that. I watched, like, the original in reruns, and I watched, like, a bunch of the, uh... Yeah, the early 2000s one when it was on, which was, like, surprisingly good. The the 2000... The early 2000s one was fun because it was one of those cartoons. It's like, let's take, like, the classic 80s one... Which, you know, is fun and has a lot of fun concepts, but technically is not very good. So let's just do that and, like, do it better. <sighs> Wait, no, no, no! I don't know! <laughs> Come on, this is bullshit! No! I didn't know if I knew... If I had known that I 
could have done. If I knew I could do. <laughs> <laughs> what killed me? Why do I die? <laughs> Getting killed by the screen scroll is such bullshit. Garbage. <laughs> oh, God. Ow, no. Okay. I know what to do. Oh! Oh, good God. Ooh. Yeah, I, I, I enjoy Masters of the Universe, like, frick, for, like, the aesthetic of it. Like, just the, the core idea is that it's, like, an alien planet with, oh, God, beefy barbarians and wizards but also got, like, weird, futuristic, but, like, totally, like, wacky and impractical technology. So it's like sci-fi barbarians, basically. It's like Conan the Barbarian, but with weird sci-fi bullshit. Oh, God. Damn it! And there's so much that you could do with that. Man at Arms. Oh, yeah. He was cool. He was voiced by Gary Chalk in the 2001 version. 2001, 2002, whenever it was. Oh, <coughs> oh God. Oh, God. Oh. There we go. Oh, no. No. Okay. Uh, also, yeah, the Zilla wanted me to do my Skeletor voice. <coughs> Let me see if I can bust it out here. My uh, my voice is a little low today. <coughs> One of these days. <coughs> Someday the gates of Castle Grayskull will fall before me, and all of Eternia would bow to the will of Skeletor. <coughs> Beast man, you bumbling boob. I might need to warm it up a little bit today. I can do I can do better, but I my voice is a little bleh, I bet, today, so it's fine. Oh, the enemy was not spawned here. I will take it. Okay, okay, okay. All right, everything's good. Yeah. Don't strain it. Watch me. Watch me go. I'm gonna scream at this game for four hours. Oh boy. Ah. Yeah, I was kind of up late last night working on the uh, the new video, getting that finished. I did get enough sleep. Like, I got, I went to bed and I slept in, so I'm not, like, overtired or anything like that, but, yeah. Whoop! Okay. Yeah. I'm sitting in my lower register more than usual, not that you ever mind that. Oh, do you, uh, do you like it deep, Apple? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, Lordy Lou. Come here, you bastard. There we go. Woo! All right. Uh, uh, okay. Okay. Huh. No, 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 I hate in my heart, and I need it out of my body. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay. 
Man actually looked different from switching to Adam and He-Man. Yeah, that was like a weird thing in the original cartoon. Like, you know, pe people will always uh, bring out the Car Clark Kent Superman thing of him just, uh, uh, you know, putting on glasses or whatever. Um, I always thought the He-Man one was way more egregious. That He-Man and Prince Adam were supposed to be secret identities, because yeah, they looked com exactly the same. Like in the 2000s one, they at least made the, uh, you know, the difference. Uh, uh, like He-Man was a lot bigger and beefier than. Oh my God! Why are there two? Like they look like physically different people. Like, they look similar. Like, He-Man was like a bigger, beefier version of Adam. But I guess in that regard, it's almost like a Shazam Captain Marvel, like Billy Batson situation. Where he's like a bigger, stronger version of himself. Oh. <sighs> okay. Ugh. But yeah, the kind of situation where, um... Um... Well, I, th I think one thing with the whole He-Man thing, like He-Man having a secret identity and people not realizing it as opposed they probably didn't even realize that oh god uh, they probably didn't even realize that He-Man he even had a different identity like I don't, I don't remember if that was ever like a plot point of anyone like trying to figure out like who He-Man really was but, you know, this is a world where people have names like Man-at-Arms or Manny Faces, you know? They probably just think he's He-Man all the time. Which is like, I, honestly, I think one aspect of, of uh, how Superman gets away with it is that I feel like people don't... Uh, but I feel like a good way to address it is that people don't think that Superman has a secret identity. Or, you know, they, they know who he is. He's an alien, and, you know, whether or not they know his name is Kal-El. But... Well, in the Superman thing, oh god. I feel like you could explain the Superman one away a lot just by saying that people know that he's an alien named Kal-El. And so it's like, okay, well, that's his secret identity. That's... What's Superman's real name? Who is he actually? Oh, he's an alien from the planet Krypton named Kal-El. Like, that's his secret identity. And why Why would anyone think that he has a human identity? You know, he lives in the Fortress of Solitude. You know, he has a home. Why would they think that he's also a dude from Kansas who lives in Metropolis and yada, yada, yada. But also, I think, the you know, the whole thing with Superman's identity and people being concerned about the, the fact that he conceals his identity with... Um, uh, a pair of glasses is also a little... It's like a silly thing to caught up, get caught up on. Um, when you're talking about a, a character who can fly because the sun is yellow. You know? Th this is a guy who can fly because the sun is yellow. And the part that you're, get, you're caught up on is the fact that he conceals his identity with a pair of glasses, ostensibly. Or you could just say, you know, the other way to think of it is that it's just like part of his power set, you know. Superman has like a million bullshit powers, so... Uh. Okay. Oh, 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 Yeah, people rag on the Clark Soups thing too much. I mean, there's also just the fact that Superman is very traditional and 
classic. He's basically the prototypical superhero, you know. When people think of, like, the modern superhero. And I don't know if he's, like, li literally the first one. I haven't, like, there might be, like, some that predate or whatever. And the concept of the masked vigilante goes back before him, but... In terms of, like, the modern superhero concept, Superman is, like, the one that popularized it. Or one of the originals that popularized it, at the very least. Okay. Zoro, yeah, Zoro is, like, a, uh... An example of a of a pre-existing idea of like the masked vigilante, you know. Okay. Oh god! No! No! no, no. Uh, oh, oh. Hang on! No! No! Uh, no! God damn it! Oh yeah, the domino mask thing, like with the Green Lantern movie. Yeah, that's one of those. It's, it's got to be a suspension of disbelief thing, you know? Oh, God. It's like, it's not... Th the fact that Robin conceals his identity with a domino mask is, like, not the point of the story, you know? At, at, at that point, honestly... Like with any suspension of disbelief, oh god. Like with anything in fiction that involves suspension of disbelief, just like accepting something as true in order to enjoy the story for what it is, as long as, as it's got internal consistency, like that's the important thing. So, you know, for Batman stories, you just accept that, yes, like... God damn it. You just accept that, you know, covering their eyes in a domino mask is enough to conceal their identity and then you just roll with it, you know? Whoop. Oh, okay, we're good. This level has been kicking my ass for a while. Hang on, I gotta focus in. No, god damn it, I banged my head. I hate. I hate. And yet, it, it is more than just the pair of glasses, of course. And that is like the most obvious visual indicator, but just, you know. The hair posturing, how he presents himself, all of that stuff, but yeah, it is just. Oh, god damn it. Hi, Moon. How's it going? I hope we're having a good weekend thus far. Thank you for joining us. Sorry, skeletons. Uh, uh. Getting better, maybe. That guy is bullshit. God, I'm getting my shit pushed in. Ah, ow. Okay. Ah. Whee! Whee! Uh, okay. Yeah, it wouldn't be a clock tower stage if it wasn't completely stupid. Honestly, like, the biggest problem is just the fact that I get killed by the screen scroll. No. Okay. No, why are I, there were like three over there? What is happening? This is garbage. <laughs> no, why am I down? So if they're skeletons, do they multiply by boning? Huh. Uh. 
Oh god. over here. Let me whip you. There we go. I whip my whip back and forth. I know. Oh. No. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. my butt move. Wait, 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 wait. <gasps> no! Oh, I made a mistake! Okay, oh god in heaven. Ow! Ow! No, this is a bad run. This is a bad run. Let's, uh, let's take it again from the top. Okay, 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 okay. This is happening. We're all just going to agree to be okay with it. Woo! Get back here, you bitch! There we go. Ah, nice try, dickhead. I'm the best. Oh, oh yeah. We got the no cookie. Ah, ow. Oh, oh. Okay, okay. All right, that was a wake-up call. That was a slap in the face. I needed no fat bird. How's it going? Thank you for joining us. We're having a good weekend thus far. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Get back here. Get down here. Ah, I'm gonna whip you in the face. Uh oh. 
Oh. Yeah, get wrecked. Okay. 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 No! Woo! Huh! Oh. Okay. All right. what daddy likes and there's food okay I'm cheesing this effort Hot nonsense, and Daddy wants a checkpoint. Okay, here we are. Alright, get wrecked. Whew. Oh god, I'm sitting on my foot and starting to feel like what TV static looks like. Ugh. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Alright. Oh. Huh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, red skeleton. Oh. Boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh, uh oh, spaghetti oh, so mummy. God, here it comes. Where are you going? Where are you going, mummy? Mummy, mama, 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 mama. Oh God. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I flip my shit around. Oh, here he comes. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. That one, that one, that one, that one. Oh no. No, 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 Ah, so close. Is there a checkpoint there? Yes, there was. Yeah. I'm taking it. Ow, you didn't die one hit. Oh, you did four hits? Okay, well. Red skeletons are annoying. That's the health back, though. Oh, there's the whip. Okay. Oh, God.
Oh yeah. It's all coming together. I don't like this, I don't like this. No. There we go! Holy Shazbot. Huh. Oh, yeah. That's what Daddy likes! Just in case anybody was curious what Daddy liked. I got them sweaty palms now. Oh, boy. I feel like we're almost there. Should I make a restore point here? Probably. Although I'm like down on lives, so I wonder if I should just game over to restore them. I don't care about score or anything like that. Oh god. What's down here? Woo! Yeah, that's death. Yeah, let's just, uh... Let's refresh here. I did save state there just in case this gives me some nonsense. There we go. Four lives. Now we're doing better. Okay. Hi, Fudge. How's it going? Ugh. Back here. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yes. Hope you're having a good weekend, Fudge, and everyone else in chat for that matter. Oh god. Oh god, get off my ass. Yes. Oh, bridge. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh, bats. Oh. Oh, just 
just keep going. Just keep power walking, power walking, power walking, power walking. Oh, we're just gonna keep going. Yeah. All right. We live. The hell is that? Oh. Well, okay then. Can I get the spin? Oh god. Sablo! Oh god. Wait, this is the uh the clock tower theme, isn't it? Wait, no, no, no. Hang on. No, it's not Clock Tower. Oh, beginning. That's what it's that's what it's called. That's right. I knew it was, I knew it was something from Castlevania 3. Yes, you're right. It's beginning. Oh heck. Oh heck. The music in Castlevania 3 slapped. I mean, the music in the franchise is a whole slaps. The first one had Vampire Killer, the second one had... Well, the, the thing I reason... Uh, dang it. The thing with Castlevania 3 is that I feel like the f one had Vampire Killer, two had Bloody Tears, and then three had Beginning, Mad Forest, and Clockwork. So three had, like, even more bangers. <laughs> Get on the thing. Oh my god! Simon! I think Simon has brothers named Alvin and Theodore Belmont. Golems. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god! Why so fast? Well, I've never played Rondo. We're doing that one next, though. Presumably next week. Assuming we beat this tonight, which we should oh, be able to. I've got like three more hours to beat this tonight. Ba, ba, ba. Okay, hit the thing! Simon! Oh, you bitch! Just go. Take it. Take it. Take it. Swing. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. 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 Oh, no. No, I didn't see that one. Oh, no. 
Okay. Oh, you dick! I'm so ready for this. My anus is ready. Ow, you dick. Dang it. Jump button. That's not where you are on the controller. The f spot that I tried to press. So, I think that was my fault, mostly. Okay. Also, speaking of Castlevania music, I will say that whatever you think of Judgment, the uh, the renditions of classic Castlevania themes in that game slap so hard. Death Note, but the Death Note art style was weird for that. For those who don't know, Castlevania Judgment is a fighting game. It's a Castlevania fighting game where the character design was done by the Death Note person. I was gonna say guy, I don't know if it's a guy, girl, or neither, whatever. I got it. Oh, it's time to go. Oh, no. Oh, 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 Yeah, Maria get yeah, that that's the part that's weird. Yeah. Maria getting jealous of Sifa's boobs. That is weird. I I haven't played Judgment by myself. I've uh, for myself. I've watched like uh I I seen Queen Pit play it. Aside from that, I've just listened. To oh, frick. That was my bad. Oh, okay. It's fine. But yeah, it's like It's like you don't need to make all of the female characters overly sexualized because it's a vampire game. You can make the vampires as sexy as you want. That's part of their deal. The vampires should be really sexy. <laughs> Oh, you dick. I got greedy. Nuts to the candlesticks. I just want to make sure that I get my whip powered up. I know which ones those are. You dick. You were in the way. It's fine. I can do it. Oh. I can just hit that one to get it the first one. Okay. Oh god, why? Alright, I'm losing it, chat. I'm losing it. I gotta get it back. I need to not be losing it. To 
Did I not? I don't know. Whatever. Huh. Yeah, I didn't get the, uh, the longer whip. I don't know why. Not the, uh, <clears throat> oh well, whatever. Doesn't matter. Huh. No, get away. Ugh. I think once I'm here, I'm basically, there we go. I think once I'm here, I'm basically safe from it. Alright, you know what? Let's just go ahead and do this real quick. Let's do that. I'm here with full health. Huh. Huh. Ooh. Ooh, I see. Huh. Uh. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, I'm going ram. Okay. Uh, oh, balls. Oh, too many Christmas. <laughs> Why didn't he land on the stairs? Okay. Ow, that was my bad. I'll look up that. kind of need to keep moving left with the way that the platforms are all just going right. Yeah, baby. Ha! Ha! Get wrecked. Skeleton! Yes. Oh. oh! Ow, you dick! If I get killed by the screen scroll, I swear to Christ. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh. Alright, you know what? F. This. I'm standing here with full health and I'm safe. What the fuck? That was a good idea. This was a good idea. Let's go this way. Yeah. Can't jump off the stairs, can I? No. This is the smartest save state I've made in my entire life. I've save stated a lot playing classic games. I've made many a save state in my day. This is the smartest one I've ever done. Huh. Save stating at the top of these stairs is nothing short of genius. visited the gap we got some new pants I like how the um 
the world ceases to exist and uh, just becomes a yearning void of death as soon as it's out of my vision. Yes. Oh, this seems good. Let's, uh, let's do this. I bet I can. Oh, I can't reset this room to get more hearts. All right, well, fair enough. We're here now. Uh, is this death? What the hell are you? It's a Chozo. You're in the wrong video game. Go fight Samus. What is this? Where do I... Okay. Got a checkpoint there anyway, so... What? Are they like weird bird creatures? Oh my god. Okay. Ow. Oh yeah. Alright chat, strap in. This is gonna be a minute. This is gonna- be, we're gonna be here for a minute. Oh no, he's more powerful than the sausage tongue. That one was the worst. Oh, that was the wrong button. Ooh. Drop a different sub weapon? I doubt it. Probably don't drop any sub weapons. Yeah, no. Okay, 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 okay. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. Ow. Oh. Oh. Oh, he's so fast. Oh. Too fast. Oh, God, he's so fast. I feel like the axe is not a good weapon for this fight. It's the, uh, the only thing we got. Aside from the whip. Wait. Oh, he's like invulnerable when he's black. That's the only way. That, they did that to stop you from cheesing it. Ow. This seems bad, guys. This seems real bad. This seems real bad. So many iframes. 
Oh no. Okay. God, he's got so much reach. His reach is beyond imagining. Okay. Look, I am not above cheesing my way through a boss fight with save states. I've done it before, I'll do it again, goddammit. Ow. If I jump, maybe I don't. Yup. Oh, he still poke me. Oh, he's a poker. Big baller. Hello. Uh. Oh, the pokers. the blind man. Oh. Oh, I'm starting to understand. Ah. Oh. He's a big bitch. Oh. Oh, oh get wrecked. Oh, I'm starting to see, chat. I'm starting to understand. Yep. Baller, thank you for the follow, this bitch. Yeah. You big bird bastard. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. We solved one problem and found a new one. <laughs> okay. We're getting there, chat. We're getting there. Getting there. Okay. This is seeming doable. This is actually not a bad boss fight. It's hard, but it's not like a terrible one. I'm not hating this now. Like, now that I realize there are actually like mechanics and strategies to this, 
I'm like not hating this. This is far from the worst Castlevania boss fight. Ow, dick. Ow, Simon. Need a little bit more pep in your step there, buddy. Ow, dick. This is a bad run. enough the strategy I was trying oh frick the strategy I was trying when I was first fighting him is like the strat for the second half of the boss fight like I needed to figure out how to fight like the first half I, I basically already figured out the second half it's just when he has the spear it doesn't work because jumping away from him when he's got the spear he'll just stab you in the ass oh frick I need to have more patience. I'm mashing too much, and he's like whiff punishing me, basically. Oh, oh God. This is not over. Oh, but I like that I'm getting these. Okay. All right. You know what? I'm just going to... They were nice enough to restore our health, and we're not low on time. So I'm just going to... Ooh. I'm going to... I don't know if that was a random drop or not, so I'm just going to save state that again. Just going to make sure that I've got my two axe. Huh. <sighs> All right, death, I know. Oh, gargoyle? Kind of looks like Dracula, but I don't think it is. Oh. Oh, he's mailed. This is a oh, this is a good fight to have the axes in. Oh, yes! Oh hell yeah! Where's the orb? No orb. No. So no head. Oh. Oh, but I'm not at full health, though, so I don't want to save state again. There's death! There's death! There it is! I knew you were going to be here eventually! God damn it! God damn it! Oh, 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 oh. He's trying to suck me in! Where's my shit? Nah! Ah! Ah! Um, I'm going to load from here, actually. We're going to see if we can get to death with the, uh, the three axe and full health. Oh. 
This guy's not that bad. Oop. I say. As he kills me. It's fine. I can get through that clean enough to have full health off of uh, one of the candles here. Is the three a constant drop up here? No, that was a random. Okay. I, that's fine. I didn't want to... weapon right now. Oh, it's because I ran out of hearts. Okay, maybe I'm not going to worry too much about the sub-weapon on death, then. Uh, is it even going to give me one? Probably not. Uh, hang on a sec. I know I didn't save state again, but... Oh god, the way he, I'm like, my movements are weird. I don't like this. <laughs> Imagine having sub-weapons. I know, right? I don't think they're gonna like actually help against death all that much so I'm just gonna beat this guy again and then okay. you think they're called sub weapons because the whip is a dom weapon That's going to be super helpful. There is a... Okay, so there's a chance at, like, a random drop of the three there. Okay, we're going to keep fighting death. Obviously, we've got a couple hours left in the stream. But I need to use the washroom. So I'm going to stand up. I'm going to stretch my legs. I'm going to pee really quick. Guys, if you haven't moved in a while, be sure to do the same. Stand up. Stretch your legs. Make sure that you've got some water. Make sure you guys are well hydrated. And we will be right back in just a moment. Hey heroes, welcome to another amazing episode of History of the Marvel Universe. This show is sponsored in part by Patreon supporters. If you would like to contribute and vote in monthly polls, you can sign up for $1 per month over at patreon.com slash marymarvelite. The link is in the description below. The story of the Spider Slayers begins with an inventor named Spencer Smythe. Little is known of his early life, but as an adult, Spencer raised his son, Alistair Alfonso Smythe, in Glen Rock, New Jersey. A talented engineer and roboticist, the elder Smythe instilled in his ambitious son a passion for science. 
Seeking funding for his research, Spencer believed he'd found his opportunity when the Daily Bugle reported on the dangerous exploits of the masked vigilante Spider-Man. He built what appeared to be a squat semi-humanoid robot and presented it to the publisher J. Jonah Jameson. Despite his enmity for the wall crawler, Jameson initially dismissed Smythe out of hand, having already been embarrassed by his failed schemes involving the likes of the Scorpion and Mysterio. But neither man realized that Spider-Man was right there beside them in his civilian identity of photographer Peter Parker. Arrogantly believing this strange machine to be of no threat, Parker convinced Jameson to invest in Smythe's scheme, planning to easily defeat the robot and profit on pictures of the battle. However, he soon realized he'd underestimated the machine when it demonstrated numerous metal coils which could deploy from the front and successfully ensnare even someone with super strength. And so Jameson remotely piloted the robot, pursuing Spider-Man through the city with his face proudly displayed on the view screen. Furthermore, the machine was equipped with a device capable of detecting spiders and similar organisms when they were in range, allowing it to track its prey. Having underestimated his opponent, Spider-Man was caught, but while his strength... Okay, I'm back. Also, look who's awake. The baby is up. The baby. Hi, baby. You're a good girl. Come on. Come back. Come back. Oh, show me your butt. I want your butt. She's yelling at me because we want she wants me to go lie down with her. I'm not gonna <laughs> Okay. There she is. Alright. I'm gonna get a sip of water now. Ah. Okay. All right. Okay, death. Okay, death. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like maybe I should see if I can get past that previous boss and get here with um, the axes um, before I save state again. Like, and have full health, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. That boss is not, like, that bad, so... I can't hurt you right now, can I? No, your health... Well, your health bar is there. Oh, God. Well, I run out of hearts anyway, so... Probably not... Oh, God. Lalo, how's it going? Did all this without sub weapons? Uh, you know what the thing is. Here's the thing, I'm running out of hearts anyway, so they're probably not. Okay, I'm gonna try at least one more time to see if I can get through this previous fight, taking little enough damage to get healed off of a single thing. Oh god. Well, we're off to a bad start. Apparently not. Ow. Right, let's try this again. I'm just trying to get into a good position for death and for the fight thereafter. Ow, dick! Well, that's not good. I'll do my best, Lalo. By the way, if you guys are not following Lalo and Dine, you absolutely need to get on that action because they are an absolutely amazing uh, monster girl, Duran, uh, synthwave, uh, connoisseur, VTuber. Would you say all that is fair? Anyway, Lalo is cool. Follow Lalo. Oh, God.
The monster girls are primo and the vibes are immaculate. Bad situation. <laughs> like, I can beat this guy. That part is not that much of an issue. The question is if I can beat him with uh, enough health left to uh, fully heal off of the uh, thing. My goodness, Paladin Verdant! Thank you so much for the 10 month resub, that is awesome! Speaking of awesome VTubers, you absolutely need to follow Paladin Verdant as well. Thank you, thank you. I hope you're having a good weekend thus far. Huh? Okay, I did it. There we go. That's the business right there. Uh, you know, I'm gonna make a restore point here. And we're gonna see if we can get the three X. We're gonna see if we can get the random drop on that one. Because it does appear to be a random drop. I don't know if there's any way like to manip- Oh, there's the three. All right. Oh, actually, can we? Oh, can I farm hearts here, I wonder? Actually, first off, let's make a restore point now, because we got a nice, good one here. We got a nice, good save state there. Oh, we can't go back down. Okay, we can't farm hearts. So this is this is what we got. So, like, the three axe is not going to be super useful here, but potentially for what comes next. You know, oh, God. firm has run dry. Apparently so. Alright, well. We are going to need to rely mostly on the whip to deal with this, but I feel like that's kind of the intention. Theoretically, any boss should be defeatable whip only. Oh, hang on. Where do I... Oh, what? Oh, well, I'm under here. Okay, that's not what I want. Oh, God. What? Hang on. What the? Okay. What if? Ow. God. I don't think I have the strat down for this yet. <laughs> we're still, uh, we're still feeling this one out, chat. We got the king of the bone boys over here. Wonder what's behind the curtain. There's definitely gonna be something. Dang, dang, dang. At this point, I'm kind of like experimenting and seeing what works and what doesn't. Like, I'm trying to see if there is a actual... St it's, it's when he goes into the bottom right corner and like shoots out the spinny thing that I really don't know what to do yet. Okay, I dodged it that time. Oh! 
Okay, it is dodgeable then. Oof. Oh, that was too soon. Okay, we're starting to get there. I don't like how he tries to pull me into the corner. I would make some kind of joke about him trying to suck me, but um, I legitimately don't like how he tries to like pull me into the corner. It's uh, very tricky. Oh god. halfway that time. I feel, I feel like I'm just gonna have to kind of keep getting better and better at this. I don't know, it feels like there's not necessarily like a trick to it, I just need to keep getting better at it. God, his scythes are so fast in this one. tricked me. Huh. Ah! Okay. <laughs> Hello, Laura. How's it going? Thank you for joining us as well. I hope you are having a good weekend. I hope everybody is having a good weekend. While we attempt to kill death again. This bastard. This bony bastard. See, I'm getting better. I just gotta feel it out. God, I'm no longer winning. Ow. This guy better not turn into a big skull again, I swear to Christ. Oh. Okay. Walking in there with my Belmont strut and my big beefy thighs. Shits are so much faster in this one. Oh, oh. Oh, God. The little shits. Ah. They're so quick and nimble. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Don't work when he's in the corner like that. Nonsense. Absolute garbage. I swear to God. Uh, we're toe to toe. Yeah. No. Ah, uh. oh, you dick. We're getting there, chat. We're getting there. I'm gonna get this guy. 
I'm gonna get his ass. I'm gonna get his bony, bony ass. Oh. I had hope. I had hope in my heart for a second, and that was a mistake. It was a mistake to dream. <laughs> I had light in my heart for a moment, and it was snuffed out. Abandon all hope. Okay. Going back in there, big beefy thighs. I got greedy. I was greedy. I was a greedy boy. <laughs> oh, the greed. Done in by my own hubris. I don't know if that was hubris as much as it was, as, as it was panic. It's probably more panic, if I'm honest. Oh. Sub weapon is best for this guy. Like, I don't really have an option to switch at this point. Like, we're stuck with what we got, but. I wonder if you did have the option, like, what one would be best. we got this this guy is honestly not that this guy is honestly not nearly as bad as castlevania 3 death unless it has a second form in which case i'm gonna jump in the toilet and never return ah, Ugh! <sighs> 
Oh, come on, dude. I didn't get a, uh, I didn't get a good start, of, uh, start that last round. That last one was kind of off to a bad start, so... Pretty good. Dang it. Damn it! I'm gonna get it, chat. Eventually it will die. Eventually I will be the victor. You ass! Scared chat, it's not over yet. Oh god. <sighs> oh, here we are, it's Drac time. Oh, oh. Hang on, I'm going to restore a point here just in case I F this up. <laughs> Wall turkeys, my beloved. Yes. Okay, we're not going down there yet. Oh, shoot. I did F it up. I did F it up. I knew I was gonna. I knew I was gonna. Yeah, okay. That might actually be good, but... I've got the three, so I want to... If I get that, then I don't have the three anymore. Pretty sure that's how that works. Hang on. Let me see. Yeah, we know what the stairs mean. We've been here before. Yeah, that removes the three. If you change your weapon, then it gets rid of the, th the three. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, chat. Okay. Uh, only 16. We're gonna need more than that. Well, there is a time limit, so...
Oopsie, god damn it. <sighs> I'm very smart. I don't know how long this fight is necessarily going to take. Yeah, I'm keeping an eye on the timer. And also, I'm gonna, like... I'm gonna be... I don't want to save state with, like, a low timer, if that makes sense, you know? So I'm gonna, like... I'm gonna do a bit of farming now, and then I'm gonna try it. But I'm gonna be, like, wary not to save state, because I don't want the, uh... I don't want to save state on a low timer. I'm gonna need at least 30. 400 seconds is probably enough. I mean, I'm gonna go in there and die very quickly anyway, so. All right, let's just go in and kind of see what we're dealing with first. I wish I could have more than one save state on the Wii U. What is this? Oh god, there he is. Okay, this is very Castlevania 1. Oh, this is different though, the way the things go up. Oh, okay. figure out what the best way what the best way to dodge that is yeah maybe I am better off with the um with the boomerang with the cross I got my save state there anyway, just in case. We'll see. I doubt I could get a two or three to drop. Right now, I'm just kind of experimenting. I go. No, that doesn't work. Okay, there we go. That's how we dodge it. Okay. Okay. Okay, it looks like the default timer on this is what, about 350 when it starts. Uh, they're probably not going to drop a two or a three on any of these candles. I doubt it. I wish this would stop being turkey when I've got full health. Okay, well that one's a... okay. When I've got the weapon already, that one there is a big hurt. I don't need to hit that first one again.
do one more, and then we'll uh, we'll go in. Uh, I I wish I could make more than one save state on the Wii U. I really do. Even if I could only have two, that would still be useful. Okay, let's go in. 58, that's fine. Here he comes. Oop, I hit the wrong button. Off to a bad start. Real bad start. Oh, I can just whip that and make do that. I'm dumb. Oh, hang on. Oh, what? gonna try some stuff here. I don't think the axes are any good here. So when I continue, does the timer just continue from there? No. Okay, so the default timer on this is 350. Okay, hang on. if there was a chance for these to drop two or three. But I guess that's not really super relevant regardless. Although he's gonna have a second form. At that point, the triple three axes might be useful. All right, I'm not gonna rewrite the save state anyway, not yet. Lord only knows triple axes might be useful later. Hell, if I can like beat the first form with the whip, and then axe the hell out of the second form, maybe? I think I know what the second form is, just based on previous Castlevania games and things I've seen online, but I'm not a hundo. Also, this can be a no prize. Um, question to the chat exclamation point no prize um or is there any other thing like aside aside from during the actual fight like potentially getting drops off as fireballs or whatever but before the fight is there like anything to farm off of except for these candlesticks like is there any like anything secret hidden in the walls or anything like that Or 
Or is it just the candlesticks? I'm assuming it's just the candlesticks and there's like nothing else to firm off except maybe something during the actual play. Secret invisible platforms under the stairs. If you're trolling me, I'm going to slap you, I swear to God. That sounds like a troll. That sounds like a troll. I'm gonna try that. You know what? I'm gonna try that after this attempt, and then I'm gonna see if you're playing me. All right, 350 seconds. Let's just go in. I've got 91 items. Ninety-nine. Oh god. Oh, frick. Frick. Wrong button. Oh, frick! Oh my god. That sucked. Uh, alright, let's see. Woo! Oh my god. Huh? Curious. Chat. My God! Ah! Holy shit! All right. Well, that's there. Whoopsie! <laughs> oh my God. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. Good to know. Good to know that that's there. <laughs> you sneaky bastard of a game. All right. I'm glad I know prize for that. Some bullshit. <laughs> it drops the two and three. Oh, God. Now I, I just got to get back up. Oh, God. Who, how, who would ever try that? <gasps> That's, you, oh, Konami. Okay. Sneaky bastards. Oh, okay, getting back up onto the invisible platform is a whole thing. Okay. God. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, Jesus. At least it's in a useful spot. Getting back up is going to be a whole thing, I can see. If I successfully get back up, it will have earned this. Give. Huh! Aww. I believe. 
You're not going to cock tease me with this and then not let me get back up. I mean, dang it. Hang on a sec. I can do this. This can be done. This can be done. Yeah, it's like right at the edge of the castle is where it drops off. Oh god, how please? Just let me back. Let me back up. Come on, game. I don't ask for much. Is there something I'm missing for getting back up? Oh, heck. Shenanigans. Or like an invisible oopsie, an invisible thing to like swing off of or some bullshit probably i bet there is i bet that's what it is oh there's stairs invisible stairs you know what that makes sense of course there is i'm like jumping there we go Oop. okay i got it i know i understand now i got it all right all right we in here back at it again with the Krispy Kreme. Okay. Okay. Well, this is about the best restore point we can get. All right, now let's just see if we can do it. Now we're feeling good. Now I'm feeling good about this. Huh. Hang on. Huh, he's robbed my ass. Still need to like get the actual hang, get the hang of what I'm actually doing here. Dang it! this again yeah at this point it's just a matter of me like figuring it out getting the feel for like when to jump and when to shoot and yada 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 like I have the equipment now which is what I wanted
Whoa, that was new. He's using Yamcha's Soki Don. Okay. He's doing a whole lot of nonsense. All right. Gets me in like the corner, that's some bullshit. Dang it. Ah, why is he always on my ass? Stop being on top of me, you dingus. this. Stop! Oh, oh. Oh. Oh, I can just whip tw I'm a dummy! Alright. Oh, okay. We're getting there. Stop! Okay. Okay. Okay, 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 all right, okay, okay, all right, all right, okay, okay, all right, all right, okay. Okay. Sometimes it does that bullshit. He's doing some Castlevania 3 nonsense here. Now, oh, fire demons! Ah! I got some health back off of something, though. That's good. I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay. Okay, we're getting somewhere now. Ooh, ah, get off my ass. Ah, 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 Oh, 
Oh, frick. Oh, God. If it bleeds, we can kill it. That was a good run. That was a good run for a minute there. The fire is some bullshit, but we're getting through it. Dang it. Ah. Ah, heck. Got him like halfway that time at least. Okay. This is a heckin' frick, dude. This is a real heckin' frick. As far as Dracula fights go, I feel like this is not going that bad. Oh, that was a mistake. I'm getting off. Oh, hang on, this is a bad run. I'm like off of my rhythm entirely. Hang on. Okay, hang on. Okay. All right. Okay. wrong again. I'm doing this wrong again. Something is going wrong. No. Whoa! Oh, give me the thing. I got greedy. Oh, what only killed one? What the flip? No! Oh, heck and heck! Heck and heck! 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 I don't like the fire boys. Okay. Need to get the hang of the, the fire boys.
teleported in front of the chicken, the big bastard. Heckin' the thing that keeps getting me now, the hardest part of it, this is how the uh, the fire heads um, fall down when you hit them. That's like the hardest thing about this god. I keep getting hit by the falling fire heads. Ah, oh, because they like keep going like diagonally when I hit them. Freaking Dak! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, Spidey John, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Some good hits there. Oh no, oh no, oh, what is this? Oh, oh. How was I to know? How was I to know? Ugh, okay. It's the furthest I've gotten, so it's not bad. <sighs> oh, sorry, did the sound alert jump scare you? Sorry. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. God. Thought it was gonna be. Oh god. Oh god! The fire heads! Oh damn it! I'm so angry. I'm telling you, man, it's the fireheads. I like, I don't have them down yet. I will, eventually. I will get them. I will get the hang of it, but as of that run, I did not yet have them down. made up for a little bit.
Darn it. Oh, shoot. Ah, oh, heck. Oh, heck. Oh, shoot! Oh, I got greedy. Okay. I got this. We're getting there. That was a good run. That was a really good run. It's okay. It's okay. I'm feeling good. I know what to do in that... Uh, now I know what to do in that end zone. Like, I, it took me a second to feel it out. A rough couple of seconds that just happened. Dang it. Dang it. Okay, that was not a great run. Okay. Obviously. Okay. Okay. I missed out on like another heal like right near the end there. Oh shoot.
Oh, oh, almost there. Almost there. <sighs> almost there. We almost got it. By a little more health going into that, uh, yeah, that second phase than I would have, uh, would have had it. Oh yeah, oh my god. Should I? I'm doing it. I did it. I can do this better. I can do this better. I can do this better. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Just hang on. All right. I know there's going to be another thing after this, so I'm like, it's fine. going for it now. This is the this is the ch attempt. trust it. I don't trust it. Really? Huh. I was convinced there was going to be another one after that. Wow, okay. There's our boy, Simon Bermondo. Huh. Yeah, I thought there was. I thought I've seen, I thought I've seen sprites of like a second form Dracula in that, but maybe not. All right, we did it then. <laughs> June Ferrano. 
Do we have, like, actual credits in this one? Player, programmer. Raipon? Gaipon? It's hard to tell with a font. Oh, I remember this thing. Enemy programmer. Great K Ninja. Alright, this was a fun one. We still have about an hour or so left in the stream. Um, we don't have time to start the next one, so I'd have to uh, hook up the other system. Is he picking up bat meat? That wouldn't surprise me. So, uh, I'm assuming that goes in the new game plus? I don't know. We'll see. I think the NES, uh, the instruction manual for the NES version calls it uh, werewolf meat for like the North American instruction manual. Oh god, that thing. Yeah, it's me again. Yeah. Oh, this was trippy. The sausage tongue. Nian Kun Kara. These are probably like nicknames and whatnot. We want off Mr. Bones Wild Ride. I know, right? That one was the worst. But yeah, this one was a lot of fun. Um, so we are going to, you know, the, the stream is not over yet. We do have about an hour left in the stream. So if this kicks us into like a new game plus, we'll just play that for a bit uh, until the timer runs out, basically. Um, and then uh, uh, next week... At the same time, we will be starting Rondo of Blood. Now, there are multiple versions of Rondo of Blood. The one we are going to be playing, is the one that I have, um, is the version that's on Castlevania Requiem for the PlayStation 4, which I believe is a port of the PSP version. Which is to say it's not like the Dracula X Chronicles version or whatever. It's like the... I, th I believe it's the PSP version re-released on PS4, like Dual Pact with Symphony of the Night, which we'll be playing after Rondo. So, yes, for those who are following my along with my Castlevania adventures, next one is Rondo of Blood, Symphony of the Night, the versions that were released together on PS4, which I believe are ports of the PSP versions. And, um... Uh... Let me think. Uh, after that, we'll play the Game Boy Advance games, which I have here on the Wii. Hang on, let me... I do want to watch the credits and enjoy this. But first, let me... Let's look at the babies, because both of them are here. Both the babies in frame. There they are. There's the babies. Hi, baby. Both of the babies want attention. play some of those bad x-men snes games oh yeah i played some x-men games on the genesis a while ago they are fun but they are brutal we are going to get back to marvel games at some point on the channel here not necessarily the um uh uh classic ones because I, pl I played most of like the retro marvel games on the channel already We've got some of like the newer ones to get to that I that I haven't played yet, but that's it's gonna be a minute before we get back to that because we're doing um, Pokemon on Sundays right now, Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness. Um, by the time I'm done with that, we're probably gonna uh, Tears of the Kingdom will probably be out, and I'm going to be obsessed with that for a while. But after we're done with Tears of the Kingdom, the new Zelda game, then I'll probably do some uh, some more Marvel stuff on Sundays, uh, namely. Uh, let's see, what did I have left to do in terms of Marvel games? There was, um, we were planning on playing the Avengers game at some point, but I tried, like, loading up my disc for it that I have, and, um, it wasn't working. I don't know why. We definitely need to do the Spider-Man game at some point, Guardians of the Galaxy. I have both the Telltale ones and the newer one. Um, uh, let's see. 
Uh, yeah, I've, I've played all of the Zelda games. I haven't played all of them on stream, but I, I own and have played all of the Zelda games. I, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of uh, Zelda in general. Um, on Tuesdays, we've been going through the uh, um, Breath of the Wild. Um, just like the... Because uh, I streamed Breath of the Wild. Um, I, played the Wii, I played the Wii U version on my own time and got all the shrines in it. Um, I streamed the... Oh my god, look at this big dumb face. I love him so much. This goofy face. Um, we streamed Breath of the Wild, and I didn't do all the shrines in it when I first streamed it, but we came back to it recently and uh, um, and got the, the shrines we were missing. I think... I, I Oh yes, that's right. I remember now. We were going to come back to it again on Tuesday to try to keep doing the Trial of the Master Sword. We did the beginning trials, and we need to... Uh, take a crack at some of the later ones so yeah we're gonna we're gonna do some more breath of the wild on tuesdays i don't know when exactly i'm gonna be finished with that game if i'm gonna do like all the quests and whatnot either way when tier here's the thing i'm a huge zelda fan so when tears of the kingdom comes out um it's coming out just before my birthday which is on may 16th which is also a tuesday so on tuesday may 16th i'm doing a 10 hour stream where it's, it's an extra long birthday stream, but it's not going to be anything like too special. I'm just going to sit down and play the new Zelda for like 10 hours. I'm going to start my playthrough of that. And then that's probably going to be what I end up playing on like Tuesdays and Sundays for a while until I'm finished with it. Look at your big fluffy butt. Also, Sammy, the goody woman, says that it's treat time. So let's do that. Here you go, buddy. Nom, 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 nom. One for you, two babies. One for you, two. Nom, 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 Oh, Laura wants praise from Dad. Oh, Laura, you are doing an amazing job. I'm super proud of you. You, you. you are doing awesome. I always appreciate having you around. I'm, I'm wondering if I should add good boy slash good girl when uh, when people redeem that or if i should make that like a separate thing or uh you know maybe i should maybe what i should do is i should put a um let people enter text into the praise from dad redeem so if there's something in particular they want then we can uh we can set that up but yes, Laura, you're doing an amazing job, and I'm super proud of you. Keep it up and keep doing your best. Look at the fluffy babies. Oh, it's cleaning time now. Bath time. Bath time. All right. Let's see. Back to the credits. Woo! Oh, I remember this. This is where we were. What we were doing today. Yeah. I do like just how beefy Simon's thighs. Are, are in this. Ugh. Yeah, this is just like highlights of what we just did. Hi, buddy. All right, let's look at the cat again. There he is. There's the boy. And then there was this thing. This was actually a good boss fight because it seemed really hard at first. But then there was like a way to actually figure it out. Really cool creature design too. It's like a weird bird. Like it legitimately does kind of remind me of a Chozo from uh, from Metroid. Like it reminds me almost of those um, like X Parasite Chozo warriors you fight in Metroid Dread. Oh, by the way, if you are not familiar, guys, um, I will also be on Cath's uh, stream. Uh, later tonight. I'm going to give Katharina Game a shout out just in case you guys are not following her. Because sometimes I do show up on uh, on her channel playing some stuff. Oh, my hand tracking is doing the thing again. Stop that. Um, so if you just can't get enough of my luscious voice, then uh, be sure to follow Kath. And in uh, what's it going to be? Two and a half hours from right now. In two and a half hours, I'm going to be over on Kath's channel. We're going to be playing some multiplayer stuff. Uh, probably some Earth Defense Force, uh, among other things. But I'm pretty sure we're going to be playing that. Presented by Konami. Alright, so is this going to... These usually... Yeah, New Game Plus. Hang on. Do I have... Oh, I don't... 
Dang it, usually when they New Game Plus us, we have our uh, equipment, but not in this one. We don't have the, uh, the, uh, the triple cross. Oh well, I like the background here. This is cool looking. Hang on, before I jump back in, the boy wants some attention, so let's give it to him. Let's give the boy some attention. He's standing there staring at me. Y you know how I can tell when I want when he wants attention is if he if he sits like standing here on his stool next to me, and I look at him. If I turn to look at him, and he looks at me, and we make eye contact, and then he kind of like extends his neck a little bit, like he sticks his head up towards me. That's how I know he's like wants attention. He's like, eh, pets. Yes, good boy. Good boy. Oh, hang on. It's a little off. There he is. There's the boy. All right, this is a cat stream now. We've beaten Castlevania. Now this is a stream where you get to watch me pet my cats. I don't really have anything interesting or entertaining to say about it. It's just... Cat. It's the boy. I like how I can feel him purring, just putting my hand on his back. Hi, Kath. There she is. She do a scrim. She do a big heckin' scrim. Kath, if you are going to have me on Saturday nights for game nights, then you are just going to have to accept the fact that I am going to promote it because I'm a slut for attention. No, nah, not really. I just like being included. And we're going to shoot some bugs. It's going to be good. <laughs> you felt your name being, being said. You are summoned. Speak of the devil. And he'll be like, wah. I like the, uh, I like the Japanese superstition where if someone is talking about you, you sneeze. Like the idea that when you sneeze is because someone is talking about you. Which I guess, you know, also lines up with, you know, if someone's talking about Kath, then she's like, no, stop it, suppress. <sighs> and she just denies herself, denies herself, I say, the simple pleasure of sneezing. Was a good boy. Who is a good boy? And there's the baby. Now she wants some. Oh, look who's jealous now. I start petting someone else and look who gets jealous. <laughs> Immediately. <laughs> Immediately. You got some gunk in your eye. Come here. Come here. Almost got it. Oh, it's on your cheek. Hang on. There we go. Good boy. Oh my god, he's such a sweet lad. Look at you. Look at you, fluffy baby. Look at this fluffy baby. Look at that fluffy baby. Fluffy fluff fluff. Oh yeah. Yeah, do I have a toy or something? Ugh. Oh my leg! Oh god, I've been sitting on my foot. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, she wants it. She wants it, chat.
got the catnip toy. And a half? No. You want to rub it on your face? Sweet baby. Oh my god. Okay, she's got it now. Ugh. Hi. Hi, he's a good boy. Oh my God, look at her. <laughs> look at her hanging on to her freaking catnip toy. She's like, yes, yes, it's all mine now. Oh, what's up, bud? Oh, you done? What's up? Hi. What? Meh. Oh, oh, what are you doing? Oh. I think they want to fight. Oh. Razzle is ready to rumble. <laughs> Whenever Zant tries to like go give attention to her, she like gets on her back, hands her up. She's like, oh, you want to go? You want to go? Yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Can Zant have this for a bit? You want this, buddy? part came off. Yeah, some of it is still on there. I need to get him some fresh toys. Or like a new one of these or something like that. I need, I need a fresh catnip toy. I've had this for a hot minute now. <laughs> oh, you want it now? You want it back? Oh, Razzle, share. Share? She doesn't want to share. Fine, you can have it. <laughs> oh, the sweetums. Oh, my God. <sighs> I think we deserve some cat time after killing Dracula. I'm really surprised that there wasn't a um, full-on final form for Dracula in that one. Like a full-on monster form. I thought there was. I guess not. <sighs> oh well. I'm sure we're going to face him again in uh, subsequent Castlevania games. He's been... Yeah, Dracula's been the final boss all four times so far. I'm sure that will uh, continue to be the case. Welcome back, buddy. There he is.
There he is. There he is. Mm. Ah, okay. What do you think, Zant? Should I uh, take a crack at the uh, the Castlevania New Game Plus here? See how far we get in 50 minutes or so, maybe an hour. I think he wants a kiss. I think he wants a kiss. Kisses for the kitty. I had to kiss the kitty. And kisses for chat, too. Mwah. You guys are awesome. Oh, okay, he's going under the desk. What are you doing? Where are you going? All right. Be chill, dude. Okay. Uh, so we've beaten the game. This is going to be like New Game Plus. So this is like hard mode, basically. I believe that's how it always worked in the uh, other one. So oh, where's he going? Is he going under the bed? No. Oh, you can see his tail. All right, he's gone. All right, later, bud. Um... Yeah, the way this always worked in the other games, that after you beat it, it throws you back into the beginning of the game. It's basically hard mode, so we can see uh, how far we can get into this um, before stream ends. Just get, enjoy the look of the beginning of the game again. This is a neat thing. How it like closes the gate behind you like that. Ah, here we go. Oh, hang on, we gotta we gotta crank it. Dying, not allowed. There might be a little bit, a little bit of dying. Oh god, there's always a little dying in Castlevania. Heck yeah! Turn it down a little bit. It's kind of loud now in my ears. Try it again. Ow. Meat! Wall meat. Why was that the axe last time? Oh, I still got the axe. Well, maybe it's because I already... Wait, no, I picked up... I'm confused. Give me some of that wall meat. There we go. Gotta get that wall meat. Num 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 Oh god. Here we 
go. Anything in here? No. Get wrecked. Get whipped, nerd. Got the knife. The Kniffa! What do you have? A knife! No! Yes! Throwing a knife at a skeleton. What are you gonna do about it? Oh god, that. Oh god, bone. Oh, bone. Yes. Oh, the Grippy Boy. <laughs> Woo! Ha ha ha! Can't do this in Castlevania 1. Woo! Yeah, this game's pretty good. the power of the Super Nintendo. Yeah, because in Castle, traditionally you just go, heh, heh, heh. In this game you can go, whoop, and ha, and ya, and wah, and woo, wah. You can whip in eight directions, and also, if you hold the button, then it goes, um, flaccid. And then you can kind of wiggle it around. Go woo! Yeah, physics. Oh, the Bone Boys are back. Ha! Get wrecked. Oh! Aha! The number two. Look at that. That. Bones! Aha! Aha! Ow! Uh oh. So, let's go later. Oh, oh, oh. We're outside. I died. I got killed by the dog. Give me the stuff. Hiya! Ow! 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 Oh! Tentacle monsters! I forgot about you guys! The wiggly bits. The wiggle the jiggles. Ha! Gotcha. I wonder if there's any good passwords for this game. Like any good cheats. I think there's a password system in this. Are those snakes? I don't know, actually. I always thought they were just like piles of vines. Oh, horse heads. But if they were like a pile of snakes, that would be like... Saying that makes me... Uh, reminds me of those things in Bloodborne. Like the snake piles in that game. The enemies that were just a pile of snakes. In, like the forest area. Oh, on the horse. Oh, the horse. Yep. Yep. Ah. Uh. Wah! I did it. Woo! A bass. I got the clock. Uh, ow. Skip 
system for this game. I wonder if there's any, like, good cheats. Ah! Should have saw that coming. And I did not. Ah, ow. <laughs> well, that's a Castlevania if I ever did see one. Hang on, I want to look something up. And yeah, for cheats. Yeah, let's see here. Cheats for Super Nintendo. The boy is back in town. There's the boy. Full Arsenal found that. Oh, there's like hidden routes apparently. Free large meat. Beating the game once is... Yeah, that's hard mode. And there's stage passwords. Yeah, not really anything... Um, Huh, that's funny. One of the, um, uh, what website is this? Yeah, on GameSpot, the, one of the, uh, uh, cheats, quote unquote, one of the, one of the things in the guide here is, uh, uh, it says it was submitted by Deacon Frost, which is a vampire in Marvel Comics. Deacon Frost is the name of the vampire that, uh, bit Blade's mother when she was pregnant with him. Alright, where would I continue from? Out here? Okay. Oh, wow, right at the beginning, huh? Okay. Let's do our save statey bullshit to see uh, how far we can get in the next uh, 40 minutes or so. We're, all, we're going out on a high either way because we killed a Dracula. I'm really curious about Rondo of Blood because I've, you know, the, the NES games, I've played them before. Um, oh. uh, I think this game I've probably played before. I've at least seen it. Rondo of Blood is the one that I don't know, like, a ton about. I think it's going to be the last, like... It's kind of the last really classic style Castlevania, I guess, before we get to Symphony of the Night. I do know that in Rondo we play as Richter Belmont, so we're still a Belmont in that one. Yeah. But when we get to Symphony of the Night after that, we're going to be playing as Alucard, who technically we've played as once before because he was playable in Castlevania 3. Actually, you know what I should do here? Let's uh, look up the timeline really quick to see where three and four take place in relation to one another. Castlevania timeline. I just want to see the years. So Dracula's Curse, Castlevania 3, was 1476. That one took place in, according to this. And this one, slash original, Castlevania 1, slash 4, is uh, 1691. So about 200 years, like 215 years. Something like that. Around 200 years. Wait, slightly less than... No, I'm right, yeah. Yeah, like 215 years after uh, Castlevania 3. And then Rondo is... 1792. So Rondo is like 100 years after this. Okay. Because the idea is that Dracula, like, resurrects roughly every hundred years. So, 
Trevor Belknot was about 200 years ago. And uh, Richter Belknot, who we're going to play as in the next game, that'll be about 100 years after this. Like, it is funny how um, Castlevania 3, I've talked about this before, how Castlevania 3 is a prequel, but if you, like, go from 3 onward, then it just goes in chronological order. So, like, it's 1 and then 2, and then 3 is a prequel. But if you go 3, 4, and then Rondo of Blood and Symphony of the Night, then those are all in chronological order, technically, because 4 is, like, a reimagining of 1. Ow. Ow. This. Oh, I see. The okay, so the meat and the axe are both in there in different blocks. I see. I understand now. fun to get to Rondo, which is still more like classic Castlevania, and then Symphony of the Night is where we're going to start to get to more of the, uh, the Metroid-style ones, where you're not necessarily playing as a Belmont every time. And, uh, I think when we... I think I am probably going to do Lament of Innocence, which is like the PS2 one, which is a 3D one. I think I am going to do that one after we play the Game Boy Advance ones, because that is... That'll be, have be, that'll be roughly when that would have come out, would be after the, oh god, after the GBA ones. Woo! And that one I think is supposed to be like a, uh, a prequel to the whole thing. Like, I think Lament of Innocence or whatever it's called, the PS2 one, is like the, uh, oh god. Uh... The origin of the Belmont clan, I think. Get out of her. No oh, bones. No bones about it. Give me the two. I do like how there is a secret right before Dracula that, like, stocks you up on stuff that you need. That's good. That's a good secret. Because it just cuts down on, like, grindy bullshit. You know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of Mega Man X1. How, um, like, right before the final boss and that, you could, like, easily fill up all your sub-tanks by equipping the shield... Oh, God! ...weapon, and then just, like grinding against the wall and, like, smashing enemies as they, uh, come out of the thing. Just, like, a quick, easy way to, like, stock up right before the final boss. Be dead, dog. Oh, God, I forgot. Oh, dog is back. I'm still hoping that, uh, we get a collection of the DS games at some point. So I'd like to play those as well, but... Uh, you know, they haven't been re-released. Emulating DS games is a bit more of a pain in the ass. And also, they're like, you know, even just to play them, they're expensive to get. So... The DS games really need a, uh, a collection. Oh, shoot. I feel like there's a non-zero chance of it happening, just because, um... They released the classic ones. There's, like, the Castlevania collection, or the Anniversary collection. They released the Advance collection, which is all the Game Boy Advance games, which, you know, I already owned on Wii U, so too late for me. Um... Ha! The DS ones weren't released on Wii, even though a bunch of DS games are on the Wii U eShop. I said, did I keep saying Wii? I meant Wii U. I've got them on the Wii U. Oh, 
but we'll see if that ever actually happens. We'll see if Konami actually wants any of my money. Or they just want to keep, you know, getting rich off of pachinko machines or whatever. Hey, gosh! Stupid ghost thing! Oh god, the horse. The horse. The horse, the horse, of course, of course. This is not gonna go well. Yeah. Gotcha. Ah. Okay, good. Ah. You know the weird thing is that there's a game for a uh, GameCube that was only released in Japan, a fighting game, that I think Simon Belmont is a playable character in it, because Konami characters are in it. Um, but it's like a crossover fighting, it's called TV Dream Mix World Fighters, and it's like a crossover fighting game with uh, between Konami, uh, Hudson Soft, and Takara Tomi. So it's got... I'm, I'm pretty sure Simon Belmont is in it. I think maybe Snake from Metal Gear? I don't remember. But I know Optimus Prime is playable in it from Transformers. And... Tyson, the main character of Beyblade, is playable in it. Which I think is the most hilarious thing. I will, I will never get sick of the fact that there is a fighting game that only came out in Japan where Optimus Prime and Tyson from Beyblade are both playable. I think Optimus and Megatron are both in it. Ah! ah oh, yeah, gotcha. Uh, ow! Oh, oh, nice try. Huh! Medusa heads! Medusa! Medusa. Oh god. Gotcha. Oh yeah. Oh no. A knife. I have a knife. Show me what you have. A knife! Yes. This is delicious. Yes, I did it. Ah, ah, ah. I'm the best gamer in the world. Get out of here, ghost. Piss off, ghost. Ha! Okay, beautiful. Uh, oh. Uh, ha! Ha! Yes. Oh. Oh, it's time for this thing. I'm out of time. God. The timer! Video games! Ah! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <gasps> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Five, four, give me the orb! Give it to me! Give it to me! <laughs> The timer was still going. The timer was still going down. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, it's a good game. It's a good video game. <laughs> oh boy. I got the orb. <laughs> Ooh, let's restore point that. Oh boy. Oh god. Okay. Oh no, the spiders that shoot the rabies! Oh, birds! Oh no. Oh, the forests are the worst. 
Oh god, I've grabbed. He's got me by the ghoulies. Ah. You're not gonna shoot your baby at me, spider. Oh, there it is. There's the baby spider. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Those are uh, those like leaf man monsters that are just like a pile of disembodied leaves. Remind me of those bug things that we fought in um, RE6. Oh god, zombie things! Oh god, zombies! Zombies! This part of the game is just ghosts and goblins. Ow! Okay, we're Gucci. Bird. Huh, no! It's satisfying how the bird's feathers just flutter down after it explodes in a flame. Yep. Oh, I got you, you bitch. Get wrecked, nerd. Oh. Chat. Ooh. We bounced off the goo. Huh. No, no. Goo, goo, goo. I'm in the goo. I'm in the goo. I'm in the goo. Frog. Oh, got him. No, nobody tell King that I killed the frog. Oh. Whoop. Don't know if it was. Oh, God, bone. Whoo. Get wrecked, bird. Frogs. Frogs! Oh god, they're dangerous! Frogs! Oh, two axes. I am SBS. We already beat the game, so now we're just uh, seeing how far we can get into the, uh, the post-game hard mode in the next yeah, 20 minutes-ish. <gasps> Wall meat. Everything's good. Everything is good. Oh, I did it. Oh no, bat. Yeah. Okay, we're good. Yeah, another the bird. Oh, okay. Um, huh. Okay. I don't want the knife because the uh, the cross is better. Cross is one of the better items. I have some music change. Final fight was pretty fun. That was pretty good, actually. Weird how there was no, like, big monster form of Dracula. But good nonetheless. Bats, bats, bats. Yeah, I'm looking forward to playing Rondo of Blood for the first time next week. Oh. Yes. Ah, get wrecked. Okay. 
I actually don't own uh, Bloodlines. I actually never played. Uh, I, I don't own Bloodlines, so we're probably not gonna. Oh, Medusa! I was not prepared. Uh, restore point. Do that there. Yeah, I'm playing these on the uh, the classic ones on the Wii U Virtual Console. I don't really feel the need to uh, buy them again. Unless the, the collection was on sale for like five bucks or something. I'd pay a couple of dollars for Bloodlines, but aside from that, probably not. I'll buy clock. Honestly, my, I honestly think my choice uh, in uh, what ones I'm doing is pretty solid. Because, come on, like the original four, Rondo, Symphony, and then the Game Boy Advance ones, and then Lament of Innocence, that's pretty solid. Like I was mentioning earlier, oh god. As I was mentioning earlier, the thing I want is I, I wish they would uh, re release the uh, uh, DS games on something. Gotcha. Oh yeah. Hell yeah! Okay. I'm gonna do a little bit of a restore point here because we got full health. We're doing good. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling good. I feel like we're gonna get to Medusa soon. Ugh. Yes. Okay, I'm sitting on my foot. It's going numb. It's good. Oh, nice. That wasn't so bad at all. Uh, Rocket Knight Adventures. Do I know Rocket Knight? I feel like I've heard of Rocket Knight. Oh, God. He's trying to grab me. I feel like I've heard of Rocket Knight. I don't think I've ever played it. Oh. Bugman. Gucci. Gotcha. Ooh, hand. Ooh, bat. Ooh, boy. Stair section at the end. Oh, yeah, like where you can get killed by the screen scroll. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
there, there were some issues there. I, honestly, like, that part, getting killed by the screen scroll, was the, uh, probably the worst thing. I mean, honestly, anything that's, um... You know, in hard games like this, I'm generally fine as long as I either have infinite lives or, like, a save state feature. But, um... Um... Instant death is always annoying. Like, pits or spikes that kill you in one hit. Like, anything that's a one-hit kill is always annoying. That's always rough. Bat! Ugh. I feel like there's a lot more bats in the hard mode. Is that is that what makes bat is that what makes hard mode hard mode? Is just bats all the time. So you beat the game now, play it again, but there's bats everywhere. That's starting to feel that right. I think that's what they've done here. I will say the stairs in this game are definitely a vast improvement over the NES versions. Although I have heard that Rondo of Blood is more in line with the NES ones in terms of stairs. So we'll see how I feel about that one when we get to it. Once again, we are playing the PS4 version, which I believe is a port of the PSP version. So we'll see how it goes. Whoa, okay. Okay, well we got that now. Whoop. Ow, dick. Woo! Alright. You need a lot of points. Yes! Because why not? I'm feeling good. I try to only save state when I'm at full health. Uh, never beat the PSP version, nothing wrong with it, but it just felt off. We'll see how I feel about it when I get to it. I've never played the original. Like, I've never played any version of Rondo. Oh, bat! There we go. Yeah, I feel like, oh god, New Game Plus mode is just... More bats everywhere. Play the game again, but there's bats everywhere. But yeah, this, this one was a lot of fun overall. Uh, let's see. Did the original game first, yeah. Same thing at night with the new voice work. Yeah. It's, it's a little sad that I won't have, like, the uh, the classic, like, what is a man? But once again, I've never played the original. I just know... I know that scene, obviously. Hopefully there's some, like... I don't know, quality of life. And, I, I hope that it's a good version, basically, is what I'm saying. Compared to, like, the PS1 version of Symphony and whatever the hell Rondo was on originally. Turbo Graphics? Chell Chelly told me, I don't remember. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, I almost, I, I'd almost rather have, like, the original cheesy voice work, but I mean, at least we'll get, uh... I, I, at least we'll get what I assume is a more accurate translation of the script. Can you imagine if Capcom ever did, uh, something like that with, like, the PS1 Mega Man games? Specifically Mega Man 8, but like I guess some of the early X games too. 
early? I guess those would be like mid, middle X games. Anyway. The X, the X games were okay with the voice acting. At least, oh god damn it. At least compared to um, Mega Man 8. Uh, there's there's got to be like a redub of the Mega Man 8 cutscenes or something like that on um, YouTube. Actually, better yet, you know, more so than a redub or anything like that. I wonder if, um, oh god. I wonder if the uh, uncompressed versions of those anime cutscenes have ever been made publicly available. X8 and Maverick Hunter had good voice work. Yeah, and the X ones were like okay. Com look, compared to compared to Mega Man 8, anything is a goddamn masterpiece of voice acting. Mega Man 8 is like ridiculously bad. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, no! Oh. But yeah, now I'm just thinking about how good some of those anime cutscenes in the PS1 Mega Man games looked. And. Yeah, redubs, whatever. I want to see, because, like, they had, I believe, in the ZX collection, they had, like, uncompressed versions of those um, anime cutscenes. So, I'd be curious to see... Um, I'd be curious to see if those cutscenes have ever been released uncompressed. Because... I, I bet they're gorgeous in, like, original high-def, standard def, I guess, but whatever, you know. Resol they're probably gorgeous with resolution bigger than a postcard, you know? Oh, oh God. Oh, I don't think I can kill that thing. No. Huh. Is this anything? Huh. Good. I have so many hearts right now. I'm nailing this. I should knife with reckless abandon. Huh. Oh. 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 Okay. Huh. Okay. Oh. Okay. I have so many hearts and I've got a goddamned knife. Singular knife. Is there anything? Uh, I'll take it. Actually, yeah. A shit ton of hearts and a stopwatch? That's pretty good. Oh. Pretty good. If I die, I lose all my hurt, so I might as well. I might as well make use of this while I got it. Huh. Oh, sh oh god. Well, this is fine. This is fine. This is good. Make good use of these. Oh. Ho. Oh. Oh. Ho. Oh. There we go. Oh, yeah, buddy. Oh, yeah, buddy. Damn it. Damn it. Now, 
I've only had a two or a three. <gasps> oh, buddy! Give me. F this. F all of this. Give me this. Give, give me this. Let me have this. No, I don't want that, though. You tried to ruin me. Knife! Ow! Okay, it's fine. Oh. Oh. No. Okay. I need health real bad. No. Later, SPS. Thank you for hanging out. I appreciate you. Right. Uh, let me load this. You know, uh, yeah. Let's have some fun with this. We got some time. Oh, the beauty of Satan. I don't want you, knife! Okay. Huh. Yeah! Yeah! Ow! I didn't even see the... Yeah. Fishman. Okay. Yep. Oh. You bastard. Simon can't swim. Let's see. Damn it! Alright, can I, like, get more health at any point here? I keep jumping into the water! This is what happens when I've got a save state, is that I get careless. <laughs> Freaking frack! Monkey back! I don't know why I rhymed that. It's fine. It's because I'm a genius. I'm a lyrical genius. Get wrecked. Whoop. <gasps> I got a three. I got three crosses and half my health. Get wrecked, bird. Wait. Huh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That guy dropped a butt ton of hearts, too. Oh, 
<laughs> so many birds. Where am I? Where did I make my last restore point? I am absolutely going to run out of time. That is going to happen. There were so many birds there. That was a bird problem. Ugh. Die! Okay. Ugh. Ow. That's fine. Let's go. Later, boys. He was a leader boy. He said, see you, skater boy. He was a little dyslexic. That's not what that means. That's like, or whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, uh, oh, bird. Mm. When do... All right, what, what am I going to stop here? I've got... I've got the three, I've got the cross. What am I trying to accomplish with this? Let's see if we can get to one more boss. Ow. Ow. I died. Let's see if we can bring this bullshit all the way to the next boss and then kill it. Let's see. It is about end of stream time, but I demand satisfaction. Oh, I just like walked up the stairs. That was fun. Oh, Simon, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, Simon? Simon, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, Simon? You've been hit by, you've been struck by, a smooth Dracula. There's something there, we'll have to workshop it. Ah, oh, God! There we go. Yep. Oh, yeah. I ruined it by getting the axe. That was the axe. I don't want the axe. God... Dang it. I'm a fool for your life. I guess the other option is just to uh, play this out without save states until we game over and see how far we get. Probably here. Oh, get wrecked. Ah. Oh god. Hit. There we go. Whoop. Yep. Whoop. And hurt. Hurrah! See you later. Correct. Okay. Whoop. Kill the bird. Done. Really, I don't need to kill that thing. That's fine. I can just ignore them. Oh, birds! Oh, birds! Oh, oh, birds! Oh, oh yeah! No, birds! Birds! <sighs> Alright, what happens if I just go? Technically, I do have that save state if I ever wanted to come back to it. <laughs> But the birds on birds on the stairs, that's like come on, bruh. Don't know if I want to deal with that. Birds on the stairs might be where I tap out. There we go. That's a uh That's a big old no thank you with the birds on the stairs. Oh god no. Ha! Gotcha. 
Ha! You whip nerd. Yeah. Oh, dang it. Yeah. Dang it. Yeah. Dang it. Yeah. Dang it. Yeah. There we go. Woo! I'm a swingy boy. Woo! No, no. All right, let's try that again. He was a swingy boy. He said, I like linguini boy. He played Super Mario. Oh god, bones. Oh god. Be dead. Woo! Oh god. <laughs> Alright, last life. Alright, last life to live. Let's focus up and just see how far we can get on this last life. But I'm really trying. I'm trying real hard. I'm doing my god dang best. Oh god! That far. That's how far I can go when I'm doing my best. Is my hand tracking not working? Can I switch off at some point? This thing is like wonky lately. I don't know. I blame Windows Update. I don't even know if like that Windows has been updating today, but my computer was a little wonky when I turned it on, so I blame Windows Update for everything. Let me reset this. I want my hands. My hands so I can say goodbye to everyone. Sometimes I need to restart it. It's fine. There it is. My hands. Oh, blah, blah, blah. come here, chat. Blah, 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 blah. Come here. Blah, 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 blah. You don't have to. I'm sorry if that made anyone uncomfortable. Uh, thank you guys for hanging out. This was good. We beat the game. They pay no attention to the thing. We're going to go over here. Uh, I'm going to play Mad Forest from Castlevania Judgment because that version of that that song slaps and that version of it slaps uh mad forest judgment there we go here's an extended version although here's the official version this one okay this probably sounds better Oh, they got clockwork in here too. Right. Put that in the playlist. In beginning, sign that one. We're gonna listen to all of them now, but oh yeah, you're amazing, Cass. And thank you guys for hanging out. Y'all are awesome. Uh, yeah, so we we did indeed beat Castlevania Four earlier tonight, which means we are going to start Rondo of Blood next week. But in the meantime. I'll be back tomorrow. We're going to be playing some more Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness for the Nintendo GameCube. Technically, I'm playing it on a Wii, but you know what I mean. Um, and also, if you can't get enough of me, then, as I mentioned earlier, uh, I will be on Kath's stream uh, about an hour and 20 minutes from now. I'm going to get something to eat really quick in the meantime. So make sure to follow Kath if you aren't already. We're also going to see who we are going to raid tonight. Let's see who is online. God, sunk slap so hard. Uh, let's see. Oh, we can't go say hi to Pixie. Pixie's still doing her, uh, their subathon over there. Yeah, Pixie's doing an ASMR subathon. Be warned, it is an ASMR thing, which normally I'm not super into, but I adore Pixie and she's good at it. So we're gonna go say hi to Pixie Bay because they are an absolute delight. They are a uh, uh, non-binary raven girl VTuber. Uh, let's see. Oh, 
probably said Raven Girl because they, even though they were non-binary because they had that on the profile, but I don't think they have that anymore. So I'm gonna stop saying that. Anyway, yeah, non-binary Raven VTuber. Um, doing ASMR right now. We're gonna go say hi to them. I'm gonna put my raid command into the chat. If you are subscribed, you can copy and paste Nightbot's message, and it'll look like mine here. If you're not subscribed, it'll look like Nightbot, so don't do that. Uh, unless you unlock those emotes for channel points. Speaking of which, you are collecting channel points for any reason, then be sure to stick around for those, because it'll give you a little boost. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, if you're collecting channel points for any reason, then stick around for the raid, because that'll give you a little boost of those. And be sure to yell Merry Raid when you get in there, because it makes the raid look nice and big. It makes me look super cool. I need all the help that I can get in that regard. So, hopefully I'll see some of you guys over in Kath's stream a little bit later. Hopefully some of you will be around tomorrow for the Pokemon stream. And I'll be back again on Tuesday, probably for definitely actually. Well, maybe. We'll see. Pay, t pay attention for Tuesday because I do have a vet appointment on Tuesday before the stream. So we'll see if that's going to be late. But I'll, I'll mention in the Discord if uh, any changes like that. Because as always, if you ever want to know what I'm going to be streaming or when, when I'm going to be streaming it, you can follow me on Twitter, join me on the Discord. Those are the places where I put the stream schedule. I know that everybody in their dog has a Discord server. Don't stress about needing to be like active in there if you're busy or whatever. But if you want to get notified when I go live, you can. There's an option for that. And I also put the stream schedule in the events tab on the Discord server so that you can see it displayed in your own local time zone. So if that stuff is interesting to you, then feel free to join over there. I think that's all I got for you today. Let's get this raid going so I can get some food in my belly. Here, I'm going to put my little reactive on the screen. There he is. That's what I'm going to look like later. Go. Let's get this raid going. Let's go say hi to Pixie Faye and I am going to say thank you guys once again uh, so much for joining me. And until next time, true believers, Excelsior!